somebody's there. Unlocks. Box, box, box. All right, go. Hi, everybody. Logan Junior Chef here. And today, I got a box in the mail. Now you know, whenever I get anything in the mail, it's going to be exciting. So, are you ready to see what is in the box? Now, today's box is not a fish. Just kind of a little spoiler right there, not a fish. It is a set of knives. <sighs> now, what's cool about these knives here is that these are actually the most successful Kickstarter campaign knife kit out there. <laughs> and these, these things are really cool. And they're, they're really wild looking. So now if you look at them, they're, I can tell you, that one's like your little, little mini knife because every yeah. knife set has a pairing knife. And then you got this really cool one. This one's actually a Deba knife, which is a Japanese um, salmon knife. So this one will definitely help me out if I ever cut up another salmon. One of the things about it is you can see this, the handle's super symmetrical. That means that it's good for mom who's left-handed and for me who's right-handed. Really cool thing about these knives. And there Say we go. hi again. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi. So then we have mini chef, fish knife. Uh, the fish knife doesn't really bend the best, but since it is one entire knife made of like one entire piece of metal, I don't expect it to bend very much, which is pretty cool that they're all 100% metal. And the one that really piqued my interest the most right here, this guy, he is just so cool because, you know, it's got that, the little like Santuco style bevels and then it's got a snub nose, which is really cool. And, you know, I just think it's really cool. I mean, isn't that just interesting? Never see a knife like this kind of style and this kind of shape. So this one is the one that's really like, whoa, isn't that weird? So I'm going to put this one back in. I can't wait to use it. What do you think of um, Kickstarter campaigns? You know, I really love Kickstarter campaigns. And, you know, they're really cool. I, I like to support them kind of a small pastime is to see, oh, what are they making here? What are they doing there? What's the latest college dropouts entrepreneurial enterprise, basically? <laughs> in other words, what you're going to be doing in three years. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. <laughs> yeah, basically. But with knives, you must have something to cut on. Now, one of the things that if you really, really watch really closely, I never really talk about Some my cutting strange board. strange lady named Kathy Davidson's on here saying hi to you. <laughs> <laughs> hi, Grand. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Grand's on Facebook right now. <laughs> so, you never really see me talk about cutting boards. Well, now I am. This is the Teak Star cutting board. Now, it's really cool and like extremely heavy, so please bear with me as I get it out. See, solid, solid teak wood. And it's got this like little, like double layover of hexagons, or he hexagons, I think. And it's, it's really heavy and really well sanded. And you can flip it over, use the other side. Now what it's planning to do is cut on this part, flip it over, and present on this part. Because, you know, it's such a pretty cutting board, I don't really want to mess it up. And I don't have very many nice, nice cutting boards. It's actually like my only really nice And where is this now? This one is actually, they're on their Kickstarter campaign right now. And you guys can go check it out. I'll post the link once this is uh, wrapped up. And, you know, I still have like a week left and you can get the the teak star, you can get the cut knives, they have all sorts of little packages, and this is actually made, or not made, I think it's designed in London. Really cool stuff, really heavy. What's the trough for? Oh, now uh, that's actually like a little juice trench, which is used for like if you're cutting like a steak. Of course, you don't want that many juices leaving, so you gotta let it rest, but if you're sometimes impatient like me, 
the juices will just kind of like not slide off onto your table, but it'll slide into this little trough. And I guess you could kind of make like a gravy, like pour it out. I, I don't, I don't know. Um, I can't. No, not really. I mean, it's just kind of there to catch the juice. Where's the little label? Oh, it's right there. So, really kind of hidden label there. Really nice. Great. Kind of soft foam packaging. And uh, teak wood is actually used on decks of ships, really s sturdy. And they're actually doing some really nice sustainability with it, is that for every teak tree that they cut down to make these, they actually plant another one. So they're being really nice, really sustainable, and uh, pretty cool. So uh, that's about it. Um, you know, Mom, can I, can I have a knife? No. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. So, you know, I, I'm still really interested in this knife here. This one. See, isn't this one just so cool? Isn't this a cool knife? It's a cool knife. Come on, guys. It's a little, little square. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> now, one of the things about it is that if you're like a kid learning to cook, these aren't really the knives for you. Because as soon as you remove this finger to put it on top of the blade to get extra leverage, it becomes a little wobbly. But, um, you know, I'll still test that once I actually cut with them. But that's just a little bit of how I feel right now. But, you know, really balanced, ambidextrous, you know, really great knives. Kind of feel nice. So cool. Are you happy? I'm happy. Are you happy? <laughs> yeah. yeah it's, a, it's a really nice cutting board. It feels great. Is that knife for slicing? Uh, this is actually the uh, slicing knife. So it, it is the, the slicing knife, I believe. They have like a little thing on the back. What are you going to cook next? Oh, there it is. Slicing knife. Right there. So... pretty cool. Um, probably the next thing I'm gonna cook is gonna be a steak. Gonna cut it up, gonna try and serve it on here. See kind of how well the juice trough works and try and see what that's like. And uh, you know, maybe do some like farm to table stuff on top. Say hi. <laughs> hi. 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 Man, this is all my hi. videos ever turned into. Just hi. So yeah, um, go check out their Kickstarter campaign. Really cool stuff. Um, it's a nice cutting board. One of my only really good ones. And it can also double as like a cheese tray and I mean anything else that you could. Charcuterie? Could you put charcuterie you on could. there? You could. They said you could. Yeah, you like it looks party. beautiful. Wouldn't it look beautiful? What do you think? Be a waiter. We be. <laughs> but it's really heavy, so uh, I wouldn't carry it around too long. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, go, go check out their Kickstarter. Really cool, really nice. Thank you so much for the love. Uh, I hope your guys' day is going great. It's Friday here, and I'm happy. It is Friday, end of the week. So having my Friday celebration, new knives, new cutting board, everything's good. Uh, hope your day's as good as mine. And uh, look for the link for the Kickstarter. Yeah, check out the link, look for the link. Uh, I'll try and post it up pretty quick. And uh, you know, uh, have a good day. <laughs> happy Friday. Bye, guys. <laughs>